I have taken from some uh, examples like so first a chart they are uh, telling about the ideas of teaching multiplications so how to teach a multiplication to children very easily just they are bringing upsetting the table with forks knives and spoons for a four people so what they are telling means you have to bring a uh, three spoons like one fork one knife and spoon I'm just writing F, knife, and spoon. So this is a one set of spoon. Okay. For example, your your there are a four uh, four uh, people in your family, or you can take how many people in a. For example, in your home there are six people. Means okay, the six people are sitting in a dining table. Just assume your six people are sitting in the dining table. You can uh, you can assume how many people's are, you can take it your number of uh, people in your family. Okay, for example, in my family I have only a four members. So I'm just taking a four members. Uh, we the four members are sitting in the dining. Table. Each members have a three set of spoon, isn't it? What are the spoons? Fork spoons, knife and spoon. Fork spoon, knife and spoon. Fork spoon, knife and spoon. Same set. So they the each table have a set of spoon. So now count how many numbers of spoons are there. How many numbers of spoons are there? Means we want to calculate the number of peoples here. How many peoples here? Four peoples here. If four peoples have a, how uh, the each people have a, how many uh, cutlery uh, unit is there? Only a three. Four threes are twelve. So there are a number of spoons uh, in in your family is twelve. Okay, you can select it like. Or, or you can also uh, you can also find it out specifically. What is specifically means you can find it out how many folks are there. See here how many peoples are in your family. Four peoples in a family that sitting in dining. Okay, so see here uh, each each uh, member how many folks are there? Only one folks are there. So four into four one is four. So totally a uh, four folk spoons are there. So the, when when it uh, as I am saying it every time when it takes a four people it will be easy one two three four you can make it addition. So when you take it as a for a twenty a uh, thirty peoples you are dining for a thirty peoples. Okay, you want to calculate how many cutleries are there? You can make a thirty into three is equal to ninety. So totally a uh, ninety cutleries are there. So this is a uh, example how the multiplication is working. Okay. So next. Putting five flowers in each vase. So what means they are telling about the flower vase? For example, there are a five flower vase in your home. I'm just drawing very roughly. Okay, so each uh, flower vase there are a five flowers. Each okay, so I want to calculate now. I want to calculate totally how many flowers are there. Now we want to calculate how many vases are there. Flower vases, five flower vases are there. So each each flower vase, how many flowers are there? Five flowers are there. So totally a twenty five. Five into five is twenty five. So totally a twenty five flowers are there. Okay, so this is how the multiplication is working. Okay, so next giving a three children two apples each. For example, this is the next example. Okay, they are giving a three children. Two apples each means, for example, I'm just naming the three children like A, B, C. Okay, for A children, you're giving a two apple. Okay, two apple. And B children also giving a two apple. And C also you're giving a two apple. Now you want to calculate how many apples are together. Okay, how many apples are? 
okay so in a a b c there are th three children so each children you are giving a two two apples so how many children are there three children are there in each children how many apples are you giving two apples are you are giving so three into two is six okay so i knew the tables so i have just uh, writing the answer 3 into 2 6 2 into 2 4 4 into 3 12 easily i am just writing the answer but you may understand these step but you may confuse how the answer you are getting here so we want to learn the tables then only we can easily make the multiplication okay so we cannot divide the multiplication we cannot divide the multiplication and tables we cannot separate if you want to if you want to learn about the multiplications of course you want to know about the tables okay let's see we will going to see the tables so before uh, before that we will just understand the basics of multiplications